Hello my lovely people, welcome back to my channel. This is Nini. This is the Beauty Fix by Nini. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you are a returning subscriber, hey girl. If you are a new subscriber, hey girl. It's about damn time, girl. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Please do share, like, subscribe, comment onto this video. And um, I hope you guys um, enjoy the video. Vibe with us. Let, let's let's have fun. So today's video is about basically my views on the makeup, no makeup uh, trend right now. Because it's really frustrating. So it basically, it just says that um, you really don't have to do the makeup, no makeup um, look. It's not for everyone. It's okay. It's okay, boo. It's okay. I mean, girl, like we have we have freckles, we have we have smile lines, we have wrinkles, we have stress. Like it's it's too much. It's too much. But um, as the video goes along, I will be talking about my own views and um, yeah. So uh, yeah, let's do this. So uh, guys. Now and again, I'll be drinking some water because it's hot in Johannesburg. Like, it is hot. <sighs> That's how hot it is. So I'm going to try to do my makeup today to be um, heat heat proof. It's, it's, it won't be a, a heavy face beat. That, that won't, won't happen. It won't be heavy, heavy face beat. But I'm going to try. So today's video is also inspired by an amazing YouTuber by the name of um, Painted to Buzz Spencer. The guy is amazing. Amazing. That's all I can say. I will pop a picture of um, the video or the yeah the video inspo that we're going to be doing today, and hopefully it will come out right. <laughs> And I don't even have a drink in front of me because it's so damn hot, God. I can't be drinking alcohol because if I drink, the makeup is gonna melt. So I'm not about that life. Nope. No, no, sorry. I mean, you know my situation. That's not happening. Anyways, enough with the rumbling. Let's get on with this video. So, uh, yeah, I'm back. So today's foundation, I'm going to be using an oldie. Uh, foundation solely because um, I just want one coat that will be enough for this look because I don't want to be like too much like uh, I don't uh, yeah. I just I, I don't want to pack it on today I mean it's so damn hot but yeah guys so um, I hope you guys are good and um, this corona corona guys it's not over so you have to be really, really careful so right now I'm just I'm just mattifying my T-zone. Guys, I'm, I'm bold today, so... I'm actually naturally bold, so... My hair that disappeared on me a long time ago. So... That's what I'm doing with right now. So, I'm just mattifying my T-zone with my um, Yardley loose powder in the color caramel that's basically what I'm doing so that my t-zone don't melt away in this heat anyways guys so the reason why I'm talking about this makeup no makeup uh, challenge type of thing um, makeup no makeup topic is because I saw an article I think was an article like I think in the internet it wasn't like a physical magazine but it was on the internet and it said uh, don't quote me it said um, how generation Z they're not really into makeup just throw on mascara and a good lipstick and a nice little highlighter and you're done I'm like girl which year is this by the way 2020 2020 has whooped our asses on top of that i'm i'm supposed to 
bring all of the stress onto my face. I need to make sure that, hey, I don't look like my problems. If I know that I got baby dad issues, I have stress, I have work issues, I have family issues, do I need to look like my problems? I need to, like, I need, I need to fake it till I make it. Like, I need to, I need to perform a magic trick. A magic trick. So, um, I'm gonna go on with this foundation. The Rimmel, yeah, Rimmel London Lasting Finish 25 Hour with Comfort Serum Foundation. So now, my problem with this foundation is it does oxidize. But I'm using this today because my lighting, my artificial lighting, does wash out my 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 foundations so when a foundation actually suits me or it matches with me in daylight with no artificial lighting it sits well but now on camera with this artificial lighting it washes out now i look yellow so i don't want to be yellow that's not happening so this i'm going to use i'm going to use this um i'm not going to use this like as heavy as I used to but I'm going to use it just hold on hold on hold on so yeah so like I was saying guys I mean do I really need to stress myself with this makeup no makeup situation I have enough stresses in the world for me to be stressing about this this look hey boo Okay guys, so I'm back. As you can see, it has definitely oxidized. So, I need to find, oh so, next up I'm just going to, oh, I'm going to do my contrary. So I'm going to go both on my um, Kerouillon palette. It's just going to be a really, really light contouring. It's not going to be too much. It won't be too much. It won't be too much, but enough for it to to show to show up. Okay, next up, then I'm gonna go in with my NYX Born to Glow uh, concealer in the color Warm Honey. I'm gonna put that just here, right over here. This is just gonna bring back some color, much needed color because she done she done disappeared. She done disappeared. Okay. I'm gonna go on. Okay guys, so I'm back. I have um, blended out my highlighter. I just added just a bit more just to give me that So yeah, so that's me. So right now I'm just going to put on some um, setting powder. I'm just going to add some setting powder. I'm not going to add a lot. Just enough, just to give me that veil, that nice mattifying veil that I need. So I'm going in with the Kelso Beauty, um, what is this? Oh, loose, it's loose powder in the color Sutherland Sky. Yeah, that's what it's called, Sutherland Sky. 
Okay guys, so I went ahead and I set my highlighter um, underneath my eyes, or actually my T-zone and as well as over here. Now I'm just going to uh, set the rest of my face with this translucent powder from the Yardley in the color caramelized. So that will just go over the face like so. So it's looking good, looking good, just powdery. Ugh. So with my bronzer, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm just going to take the tan, uh, the Lottie London Ten Time Bronzer in the color medium dark. So this bronzer I got from um, what's this place called? From Edgar's Beauty. Um, I know Edgar's. The website doesn't work so you have to go on to you have to go on you have to go to um the store you have to go in store to go get it but yeah that is that 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 is the situation we are having at hand hmm? So it, I like this um, bronzer, it gives me just like a minimal, it just gives me like a nice bronze, minimal situation. Okay, that's my mom. Okay, next up is um, I'm just going to do my eyebrows. So because I have microblading done, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to fill it in just really really lightly not a lot which means that I need to find a pencil that won't be too dark actually why not I'll just use this one Just use this one. Okay, guys, back. So I'm done with um, my face. Or oh, all I need to do is just put on blush. So I'm gonna go in with my bronzer that I used earlier on. And I'm just gonna um, give myself a nice sweep of color onto my face just to bring together everything that I've done. Bring together everything that I've done. So that's just gonna go all over my crease. That's just gonna go all over my crease. And then I'll just add a nice little shimmer onto it. So it's just a nice little shimmer. Mm -hmm. It's really, really cute. Real cute, real cute, I like it. Okay, so up next, I'm gonna take my shimmer that I got from Creative Glamour. This is a shimmer I got when I went to um, Pro Beauty, but you can go onto their website. I think it's www.creativeglamour.co.za. Then you can find um, all the shimmers and all the all the, the little um, palettes. Especially this one, this palette here, you can get this palette. So this palette, I got it, I actually, you can actually choose the colors yourself and you can build your own color story situation. So I got this, which was really, really nice. So I'm, I've had this, I think, for more than a year now. So it really, really lasts. So, so I'm going to go in with my shimmer. Actually, I'm going to use my fingers. I'm not going to use a brush. Brush is just going to disperse 
the product everywhere and I'm gonna be looking all shiny and that's not cute that is definitely not cute okay so I'm just gonna actually let me just show you what the shimmer looks like it actually looks like this let me swatch it for you it's just called a bronzer so that's that's what this swatch looks like that's what the swatch looks like it looks really pretty very very pretty that's what it looks like so it's just a nice simple pretty veil of gorgeousness basically so I'm just gonna add this onto the center of my eye and just pat it out so yeah guys uh, done my ass uh, now I'm going to do the blush so yeah like I was saying um, this whole makeup no makeup girl like the generation Z they don't have stress man. they don't have stress they don't have uh, bills to pay they don't have student debt to pay they have nothing they have nothing really really because a makeup no makeup look is going to work for a two people you know why it works for the people who have money who can afford that their skin is like glass skin you see like the korean type of skin yeah that that skin or you literally should not even have any stress lines not even a smile line on nothing basically so basically your skin like i think you, you need to be just out of pu not even before puberty puberty these people are just selling us lies out here lies i tell you lies now imagine imagine me having a whole makeup no makeup situation guys let me tell you how this is going to <laughs> pan out the makeup no makeup look i'm gonna look greasy i'm gonna age 10 years i'm just not like there'll be nothing even yo guys yo like i said i went on with my elf blush palette in the color dark got this at uh beauty shack i did check if they still have it it seems like it's sold out i haven't actually checked that it is sold out um what they do have is the cream blush palette of the same version so i'm not sure if you guys um are willing to try on the cream ones but the powder one i did not see um they do have it in other instagram i won't say instagram but other um online shops I will definitely link down uh, all the shops that they have this palette so that you guys can, can go get you some okay okay all right so right now we're just gonna go through and uh, do a highlighter just to uh, yeah give us a bit of a of a of a oh, my water's finished give us a bit of a you know a highlight here next up i'm just going to do my highlights so i'm going to use the mac highlighter i think this is yeah this is the old the old darling extra dimension skin finish highlighter so this is the one that i'm going to use i think i've i've seen a couple of uh youtubers use this um i've had this for until like yo since forever I'm not even sure when was the last time I, I've, I even used this because I haven't used it in so long. I feel like like sometimes it just can become a bit chunky and I don't like that. Okay, so I'm just going to lightly give myself so you wanna look skin fresh. Just want to look skin fresh. Just want to look skin fresh, guys. Skin, 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 skin fresh. I'm 
Okay guys, I'm going to finish off um, this look with some lashes and then we're going to go on with the lips. I'm going to do the lashes off camera and the lips, I'll come and do the lips um, in front of you guys but uh, yeah. So far, so good. Freshness. Okay guys, I'm back with my lashes dead. I really like these lashes. Um, they're nice and fluffy. These lashes are called, well, I got them from, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's called Blink Girl. Uh, I got these lashes at Channel Mode, the one by Crown Lights. So it's in a purple box like this. It's in the style A05. A05. <clears throat> so I really like these lashes. They're nice and fluffy. I can't get fluffy lashes like this at like your clicks with this cam. Um, if I do, they're hella expensive, so yeah. Leave me alone with me and my lashes. I look good, honey. I look good. Alright, so now we're just going to uh, do our lips. So I'm just going to grab this nice dark lippy. Um, not dark, but um, this um, lip liner. I don't know what it's called, but I got it somewhere. I can't remember where. It's been some time. Songs in my head, guys. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm just going to use this lippy from Catrice. I was just, um, I was just testing the two colors of, of which one I actually like. So I'm going to use this one. So this is the Catrice uh, Velvet Matte Lip Cream. That's what it says. I got this at Discam. I'm not sure how much it was. Um, I, it doesn't say any color. It doesn't say a color. So um, it's, it's like um, a nude pink. It's like a nude pink. So I'm going to use this. Oh, never mind the, the, the noise in the background. That's like a peacock. And there's the rain. Thank God. Thank God. So guys, I decided that I'm going to change my lip. Uh, it actually looks good, but... I'm going to change my lip. So I'm just going to put on this... Um, lipstick from revolution it's in the color prime um i don't know what what range this is from but this is what it looks like so i feel like for the look i'm trying to achieve it will do the trick The Catrice Velvet Mint. Mm. This is nice. This is nice. With the bald head, it works. <laughs> this is nice. Very nice. I like it. What do you think? Well, thank you guys so much for watching this tutorial. Um, I know I didn't speak too much on the whole makeup, no makeup look, but hey, like you can't, you can't, you can't blame a girl from trying. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Please do like, share, and subscribe this video. Um, please do share it, like it, subscribe if you feel like like me and you are going to be like this subscribe babes if not then oh well but thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys so much 
please take care i will see you guys next time oh and also by the way i will leave down all the products that i've used today um including the lashes as well as yeah the lippy but i'm really really liking this oh guys i always forget i always forget so i need to uh turn down the the, the powder the powdery i know on camera it looks amazing right but i know myself i need to have some spritz so that i can set it nice so so, so that it looks like presentable to the masses i mean like it's nice on camera but then in real life in real time not so much but yeah so this is my uh toner this is actually my toner this is aloe vera um toner by the body shop yeah basically so this is what i use right here so i'm just going to uh spritz And spritz, give me some life, Ooh. and the the rain, the rain. Oh my guys, uh, like you know what? The ancestors are pretty. Yes, they are pretty. Okay, thank you so much once again. I love you guys so much. Please do like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.